healthy bits for the week. Uh, um, so that I've got veg and maybe some. Hiya guys, happy Monday. It's a new week and I'm just coming to you from the car. Um, obviously, there's a few things that I've got to get done today. Um, so yeah, if you um, are just landing on my channel, I am Halsey and I'm on a weight loss journey and I have been for quite some time um, for the last two years, but my weight has gone up, my weight has gone down and obviously now it's right back up and I'm not happy, so I'm trying to get the weight off. So if you are liking my videos, hit the like button. If you want to see more of my videos, just hit that subscribe button. And obviously if you want to know when I post onto the channel, just hit that notification bell so yeah i'm off out for the morning i've got a few things to do this morning um i've got to go and do some shopping and then a, a few things i need to go and um go and do so yeah i'm going to get ready and head before school run so i catch up with you later so i hope you're good i hope you're well hope your journeys are going okay it's a brand new week to start afresh i am because last week was the start it wasn't great this weekend i didn't do a lot but it was productive i made sure that i planned out my content and sort of got a routine in place a little bit i still got more work to do to that so that's what i'm going to be doing and finishing off this week but yeah, it's a new week and I cannot wait to begin and see how it goes. So I'm going to head, do what I need to do and I catch you all later on today. I've done my best and my worst, learned my lessons. No matter how hard my life. Hey guys, I've just arrived at Tesco's to do some shopping um, and need to get some healthy bits for the week to try and do some food prepping. I'm um, not sure what I'm making this week, um, so I'll get some bits together now. Um, so I'll go shopping, grab some bits, and then I'll see what I can make with that so that I start this week strong. Um, I've got a few things done this morning and I've got the shopping to do and then some more things to do afterwards before I head home for school run. So I thought I'd just check in with you now. Um, hope you're good. I'm now gonna get out the car, do some shopping and I catch you all when I get back home. I'm finally back home from shopping. I left about half ten, quarter to eleven this morning, and it's now just gone two o'clock. So um, that's my healthy food shopping and Tesco haul done um, for today. So I'm going to go empty the bags and I'll just show you what I've got for my meals for this week and for me to be able to prep up some food to be able to um, get something to eat for the week. So I'm going to go. And let's take a look at what I've bought today. Hey guys, just going to run through my shopping that I got today. So I'm just going to take them out and then show you each bag one by one what I've got. Um, for as long as I can film because my storage is running low on this. Um, so yeah, I just got some chicken, frozen chicken um, fillets today. So they're from Farm Food. Um, and I also got some chicken thighs, so I've kept those up 
um, for the sleep. I've also got another packet to go into the freezer. Um, so that I've got a spare. Um, and I also got some meatballs. So they'd be for me or my eldest. Then I also got some prawns there to go in the freezer. So I'm going to pop those away shortly so they don't defrost. Obviously, I'll keep one of them out so that I can prep it either later on today or I'll do that tomorrow. Because um, it's getting quite late now and I'm getting a bit knackered. So I've been driving all day and I'm shattered now and I want to get a workout in. Um, and I've also got some more frozen bits here. I've got some diced beef steak. I'm not sure what I'm going to make with those. And I've got another packet there. Um, and I also got some frozen veg here. There's some mixed veg to go with the meal prep as well. And then I've also got another one here, a country mix there. So these will be going into the freezer very shortly so that I don't end up with um, a load of um, defrosted food that I can't prep up. So that's that bag. Um, this bag here is literally just some of those um, cans I got the other day because um, I really like them and they're literally, when that decides to focus, i get it so that you can see it. It's only literally like, oh, I'm not focusing. Nine calories, if I'm reading that right. Nine calories for a can. So that's the pink lemonade there. And then we've got the cloudy lemonade as well. And per can, that's eight calories per can. Um, and then I've got some fruit. I've got some apples, some gala apples there. And I've got another, another one here. Him. My eldest loves his fruit and veg, which I'm quite pleased about. And then just the vinegar bottle in there, which I won't be eating. <laughs> um, and I'll just show you the next bag in a moment. Let me just put these back in the bag. Here we go. And then I've got something to eat now. I've got some hot chicken. Um, from Tesco's, from the deli. So I've got um, uh, Chinese chicken thighs there so I can munch on now because I'm starving. Um, and I also got extra tasty chicken thighs from the deli. And I also got another one. Um, I got this one and it's just peri peri flavoured chicken thighs. So that's great. I have those in a minute because I'm hungry. I bought some eggs. I haven't tried these. I want to try and have um, pasteurized eggs and free range eggs. Um, I hope that they taste much better than the cheapy, crappy ones that you get. So I'm going to try these as well. They've got, they're rich in vitamin D and a patch of protein. So they'd be quite good. Um, and I also got some bread and some other eggs there too. Um, and I'll just show you my other bags as well. I'll show you what fruit and veg I got today. So just hold on, two ticks. Okay, and this is the fruit and veg bag. I've got some lettuce here. So I'll make something with that this week. Not sure yet. And I've got some more lettuce here. I've got some watercress, spinach and rockets. I might add that to the chicken actually in a moment so that I can have that for my lunch, for my first meal of the day. I haven't eaten yet. Um, I've got some cucumbers and some bananas. And I have these when they turn yellow. They need to ripen up a little bit. <laughs> and I've also got some more crunchy salad here for this week. Um, got some pears. And hopefully I'll get a chance to eat that because my elder seems to beat me to the fruit and veg and by the time I get around to eating it it's all gone so we've got some avocado I've got to try and remember to eat these because I never get to it in time by the time I get to it they're out of date and all squidgy and horrible so 
Um, I'll try and get to those early. So we've got some ripe bananas there. Um, we've got some mushrooms. We've got some baby plum tomatoes. Another, another cucumber. I've got some kiwi fruit. And I've also got some oranges there. So I can't wait to have those. I've got to make sure I eat it because I tend to like wait until it's uh, almost off. And I'm not able to eat it because <laughs> it's all squidgy and horrible. Um, and then the next bag is just the chilled stuff. So we've got some yogurts for me eldest. And obviously I could have some of these as well. How many calories are in this? I don't actually really know, to be fair. I've never really looked to see how many calories can I see. It's got, when it focuses, 41 calories. 41 calories. That's not too bad. That's not too bad at all. And then I've got some, just some cream, double cream, so I can do something with that. And then I've got some yogurts in there, some Greek yogurts. Here you go. And it focuses. And then I've got some butter here as well, some light olive spread. So that's great. And then I've got the next bag, which is some lemons, which I've got here. So from Tesco lemons and waxed. And then I've got another one. Oh, and there's my receipt. <laughs> Cost me a lot. I wasn't expecting to spend all that much, but it is what it is. And then I've got some sort of tortilla wraps, which I'll probably make some pizza with. Um, I've done it before and it's really, really nice. So it's a bit um, calorie, calorie, um, it's, it gives you enough calories to be able to stay within your limits and that without having a, a takeaway pizza. Um, I can't think of the words then. <laughs> you got some home, home meal tortilla wraps. And then you've also got some baby plum tomatoes. I'm not sure what surprises I've got here. I've got some beetroot and then some more salad. Yeah, some Italian, Italian wild rocket. I love rockets. And then I've just got some more mushrooms there and that's pretty much it. Oh, and I got this as well, some cream soda. Um, so it sees one calorie when I go to it. It is, and if it focuses, it might not focus. So I'll take a picture a bit when I'm having it. But it was one calorie. It's one calorie per 100, um, per 250 mil, one glass. So that's quite good. So 100 mils is also one calorie, which, yeah, confusing.com. But yeah, it's only one calorie for that. So yeah, that's great. So that's my um, shopping haul pretty much done. So yeah, I'm going to pop these away and then um, have some food. So I'll be back um, a little bit later and I'll show you my calories. That is in my first meal of the day when I'm eating it. So I'll catch you soon. Hey you guys. So I'm just about to have my first meal of the day um for day eight um i'm having my meal prep that i obviously done last week um i opened the fridge and didn't realize that i had two meals left so i'm not going to meal prep today i'll do it tomorrow so i've got this meal now which is the jacket potato with um chicken thigh um i've got cheese and i've got that yummy sauce that i used last time um it's this lovely gold one here um, I quite like that. So that's why I'm having for my first meal today. And then I'm going to have the last meal. I'm not can't remember which one it was, whether it was the rice or the pasta. So I'll show you that one later. So yeah, I'm gonna go and dive into this now because I'm super, super hungry. Um, and obviously it's getting quite late to be able to eat. It's almost four o'clock um in the afternoon. So I'm gonna go have this now and I catch you all later. So I'll see you in a bit. 
Hey guys, just showing you what I'm having for breakfast. Um, I'm having um, a boiled eggs with bread and avocado. So I'm probably going to put the eggs on the bread and then mash up the avocado. So I'm going to go and do that now and then I'll show you what it's looking like um, once it's all completed and all um, put together. So I'll be back in a moment. Safe to say, I think my scales are broken, so I won't be able to um, won't be able to do my calories today because obviously I can't weigh anything. So this is going to be a day where um, I'm not going to be able to track my calories today. And tracking my calories was meant to have been my um, weekly go and weekly challenge for this week. So I was going to update you later, but I thought I'd just show you that I'm not able to track anything. So um, when I'm able to go shopping and to get another scale, then um, I'll be able to um, obviously track my calories. So just for today, because I'm probably going to be out for tomorrow, um, I'll grab a scales then. But yeah, it's just doing this. I'm not able to even weigh out my avocado. So I'm just going to have it without um, knowing what my calorie intake is for today. So that's great. So that means I'm probably not going to be able to meal prep today either. Because also I want to know how many calories are obviously in my meal prep. So great. But here we are. I'm going to just carry on doing my breakfast and I'll be back in a moment. Hey guys. So here is my breakfast all put together now. So we've got toast with avocado and um boiled eggs and i've topped it with chili flakes um salt and pepper as well so i will try and input it into my fitness pal and see what calories it comes up with today um i'm a bit gutted that my scales have now broken on me but um i can't wait to get a new one when i can and then weigh out my food again but yeah, I'll try and input it and then see what it comes to. And then if I can, I will attach a picture um, to this video. And obviously, if I can't, then I, I'm obviously not going to be able to. But yeah, I'm going to go and have this and i catch you all for my next meal. Hey guys, just showing you my next meal of the day. Um, I'm just munching on these chicken that I got from Tesco's yesterday. Um, I need to work out the calories for that. I've got the, um, bag that it came in. I will give them a scan and see what it comes up with. If not, I'll probably just work out, um, four chicken thighs and I'll just roughly work out the sauce here. Um, it's a bit, it's a bit weird not being able to, um, weigh my food. But um, as soon as I can get some scales that are working, I'll be back to weighing out properly. But I'm doing a rough estimate of what it is. And when I manage to do that, I'll stick a little picture up there for you to see. But yeah, I'm just having my next meal, which is just chicken thighs and sauce there. So I'm going to go and munch on these. And i catch you a little bit later on in the video. So I'll catch you soon. Hey guys, happy day 10. Um, hope you're good, hope you're well. I'm just coming to you from the car. I've got an appointment this morning, um, so I had to leave early and it's just gone after nine. Um, so my appointment isn't actually until half 11, but I've had to leave super early because obviously where I am, the parking is horrendous um, for trying to park, especially um, for uh, someone who's disabled. My little one is disabled, so the car that I've got, I've got to make sure that I park somewhere so he can get out the car so that somebody doesn't park too close to my car. Otherwise, I ain't going to be able to open the back up so he can come out. So, yeah, I've got here early so I can get a spot. And luckily I did. So I've had to leave two and a half hours early just to make sure that I'm here on time and I've got a spot. So I'm not driving around trying to find one. So, yeah, that's my kind of plan of action this morning. So if you are liking my videos, hit that like button. If you want to see more of my videos, hit that subscribe button. So I hope you're good. I hope you're well. I'm not really going to be doing much while I'm sat here. It is absolutely freezing from the car. So I'm wearing my hat. I've got my coat on. My little one's got his coat on and it's absolutely freezing. 
so I'm not sure you know what, how I'm gonna warm up but I'll try somehow I might go for a walk because it is quite sunny out there it's lovely the sun's coming out there so it can nice so I might do that but otherwise I just sit here in a car and try and just keep myself warm and my little one warm so yeah there's not really much to do and then i've got to go and do some shopping because obviously my scales died yesterday and i wasn't able to track my food properly um it was a bit of a nightmare trying to put it into my fitness pal and trying to guess what my calories were so i can't wait to get that i need to go and get a few other bits as well so um hurry up my appointments <laughs> i could go now but if i leave i ain't gonna get a spot so you know that's the downside of leaving early and not having much to do but having things to do but you can't leave otherwise you're going to come back and not find a spot so oh well it is what it is but yeah um that's what my plan of action is this morning so yeah i hope you're good i hope you're well i hope your journey is going okay if you are on a weight loss journey um obviously if you are just landing on my page and you don't know who i am i am healthy and i have been on a weight loss journey for quite some time um for the last two years i was documenting my journey on here um, then I had a little break and I've recently come back and I'm restarting my journey again So I'm just obviously sharing that journey with you on this channel So if you are on a weight loss journey and you want to join me, you're more than welcome We can support each other and make sure that we're hitting our goals Because I really want to um, get to my goal weight now It's been a long time coming It's actually been a five, well six years, 2022 now so It's been a six year journey for me So I just want to get it now um and stop the yo-yo dieting the weight going up the weight going down and obviously eating naughty food i want to try and maintain my weight and obviously stop dieting so that is my plan really but it's a baby step i'm just taking it one day at a time to make sure that i do reach my goals and that it can be maintained so that is who i am so i hope you're good i hope you're well i'm gonna go and chill now so i catch you all later on in the video Hi everybody, I'm finally back at home um, after my morning out and I'm just prepping my food. Um, it's just gone quarter past three in the afternoon, so I've been out pretty much all day. I left home at eight o'clock this morning and I'm just getting home now at quarter past three this afternoon. Um, so yeah, I need to obviously do some meal prepping today. I've managed to get my scales from the shops today, so I'll be able to weigh these out. But it's literally just come out the packet, so I'll probably just use the weight on the packet um, to put into my fitness pouch if I need to. Um, or I can cook it and then um, see what it's um, weighing when it's cooked. But yeah, here is my meal. I'm just going to do some chickens because they need to be um, eaten. I got them um a couple of days ago and they've been in the fridge i wasn't expecting my scales to break on me yesterday um because hoping to meal prep um them yesterday but it doesn't matter i'm doing it now so i'm going to go and bung these in the oven for 30 to 45 minutes and then i'll come back and see what they're looking like and then i'm going to decide what i'm going to um, have with these i'm not too sure i have got salad this week so I might do that with some, probably some, maybe some rice and um, a veg and maybe some uh, sweet potato and um, a salad. Um, but I have a little think, I'll cook these up and then I have a little think what I'm going to add to it. So I've just added some garlic on top there with some salt and some pepper and some chilli flakes. Um, so yeah, I'm going to bring these in the oven now. So I'll come back when it's all done. So I'll see you in a bit. Hey guys, how are you? Just thought I'd show you my face quickly before my eldest gets back from school. Um, so yeah, it's been a long morning and long day out and about for appointments and going shopping and getting what I needed. I needed a scale. 
So I've got that so I can start calorie counting again. So I'm super excited I managed to get that so I can weigh out my food properly now. Um, so yeah, I'm just chilling, waiting for him to get back and then waiting for the food to get done. So once the chicken's done, I decide what I'm going to have with that. And then I'm going to obviously try and get my workout in today. I haven't done anything this week as of yet. I've just been super duper busy with appointments and I'm out again all day tomorrow. The weather is absolutely gorgeous outside there today. Freezing, cold, but it's um, okay. So I'll probably go for a walk once he's back. So yeah, just thought I'd check in, hop on, see how you are. I'm just chilling with my um, pink lemonade there. So just wanted to share with you what I'm having right now. Um, it's got nine calories inside it. So I'm super happy that it's not that much. And it's another go-to instead of water. So yeah, just thought I'd share with you um, how my day's been and what I'm up to. So I'm going to go and wait for him to get back from school. So I catch you all later on in the video. Hey guys, these are all out the oven. Um, it took a little bit longer than uh, 45 minutes. Um, probably took about an hour, hour and 15 to get done. Um, I wanted to get them brown um, and looking like this. So I um, can't wait to dive in in the moment. So I'll probably have three of these today and then I have two for the rest of the week. Um, but yeah, here's my food for today. So I'm going to go and put something together. Not sure what I'm going to have. Probably might make a salad. Not sure what with. Might do a bit of um, sweet potato to go on the side of it as well. But yeah, here's my dinner. So I'll catch you all in a bit when I've decided what I'm making. So catch you soon. Hey guys, just showing you my food. It's finally done. Finally at the oven and I've prepped it together here. Um, we have the uh, sweet potato and we've also got the chicken there. We've got three because I'm absolutely starving. And then we've got the salad there with the um, lovely sauce that I like. Um, and that's coming to 664 calories. Obviously, I didn't eat um, anything until this afternoon. So my intermittent fasting is out the window today. Um, so it's almost half seven and I need to get a workout in, but I've also still got, um, 986 calories left to eat because I haven't actually eaten much today. So I'm going to go and munch on this now and then get my workout in once my, um, youngest gets to bed. And then I'll probably look at maybe treating myself this, um, evening to a pudding or something to get my calories up because I'm well within my calorie intake. So we'll show you what I'm having later on. But I'm going to dive into this now and then get my workout in and so that I can edit this video for you guys to see. So I'm going to shoot, get this um, down me now and I catch you all for my workout and my pudding later on. So I catch you in a bit. Hey guys, just coming to you with my pudding. It's just um, some Christmas pudding that I've still got left over from Christmas. Um, it needs to be eaten up. Um, so that's why I'm having it now. And then I'm going to shoot to bed. Bless my little one. He was so upset. And so it's meant that I haven't been able to get my workout in because it's getting really, really late. And I've got to be up early for school run. And then I've got to head to my appointment. So another day without getting it done, but I will for the rest of the week, make sure that I am moving around and getting my steps in. Um, that's also gone out the window a little bit this week too with my appointments, but that is just life as a single mum and with a child has got additional needs. So it is what it is. Um, and I'm extremely gutted. So for the rest of the week, I've got to really try and get some sort of um, workout in um, when I can. Um, so yeah, I'm going to shoot um, after this so I can get some sleep in and get ready for my appointment. But yeah, I'm going to wrap this video up now and I catch you all in my next video. So you all take care, enjoy your evening and I catch you all very soon.